Anyway, we've got a dark old one secret to dive into. Let's keep this adventure rolling. Wow. Envy. That was the emotion that overtook me when I saw the Ursi praise you. But it came from somewhere else. Someone else. The old one. This is not the first time his feelings transferred. I inherited his guilt about abandoning Liberia. The very feeling that drove him to Caramel. He needed to reconcile the Cabal and the Arcanum so he could return to his office, to the creation he left there. I channeled that drive because I consumed him, his guilt. I didn't know what I was doing then, but I did it. Now I feel a new guilt. How do I alleviate it? Mind blown. This has been the most invigorating adventure of my life. I feel like a whole new hero. What are we doing next? And now I envy the chicken. I need time to ruminate on my situation. You and the Bantam should see if Quartermain has had any luck with that map. Like what I've done with the place? It's still a work in progress, but I've got plans. Big plans! Tell me of your adventures. Did you find another monitoring station? What bizarre monstrosities did you encounter? And is that a masked chicken? The name is Kit Barker. Most know me as the ghost who squawks. But you can call me the Bantam. Oh, I like the cut of this Hella's jib. <laughs> now, for my news. Our Lima hosts tell me there's another monitoring station in the Night Forest. It's a simple bushwhack through the wildlands. If you reach the Carnosaurs, you've gone too far. <laughs> Bantam, let's you and I look over this map. I believe I possess memories of this place, wizard. Night Forest? The name elicits no connection, but the ominous darkness that envelops the trees ahead is probably a good place to start looking. We must simply help. Oh, goodly traveler, assist me in my peril. These bizarre monsters intend to make me a meal. We must simply help the stranger, yes? That would be the good thing.
show my greatest appreciation for your felicitous rescue. I'm still doomed, of course, but not quite so immediately. Oh my, yes, I am quite doomed. Exiled, you see, from my village. Left to the mercies of the wildlands. Hopefully others will learn from my folly. It is like they dropped you down a hole and forgot you. He seems to have come from the night forest. Shall we argue on his behalf while we are there? Oh, most gracious of you, my humanoid acquaintance. My village is indeed through the night forest there. Mind the zombies and the beast. Find the elder, a lemur named Lucian. It is he who must decide my fate. I, meanwhile, will seek the company of less disagreeable creatures. The name of this place is certainly apt. We must find the lemur in charge and inquire about the crane, as well as the local monitoring station. No doubt it too is the local mana source. My gaze burns, does it? Who are you, stranger, who speaks to the air as though it were an old friend? What dire omens do you bring upon us? You seek the source of our mana? Ha! We have not a wish to spare in these dark times. Look about! We prepare even now. For the nightly assault of the Mulligast. Tis the monster that death rejected. The old judge's disappointment made manifest. Our punishment for straying from his path. We will speak of nothing and no one else until we are prepared. Consult with Goody Mary Crane if you wish to aid our efforts. You come to our aid? Blessings, then, for we have a most dire case of monster attacking village. Elder Lucian says the Malagast is because the old judge, well, judged us and found us wanting. It won't leave until we atone. Curious. What reason would the old one have for such an experiment? Thus, with the greatest of haste, we must board up the windows, patch the town wall, and gather horns from the white rhinos to fashion into weapons. Thank you, stranger. We need all the help we can get against the Mulligast, at least until we atone. And the old judge returns to slay the beast. What precisely is a Mulligast? There's no record in the old one's memories. Hmm. Fine work, but I doubt it will save us. The Malagast has always been a danger, but lately it is as a demon unleashed, and nothing can stop it. Could this Malagast problem have been exacerbated by the mana infusions? Like the volcano in Ursai? If so, Hierarch Lucian may have misread its meaning, as Juju and the bears did. At any rate, shall we find these white rhinos?
Yes, Mary Crane will want these. Zombie rhino horns. My, the line between life, death, and undeath seems nebulous. How do you keep existence straight? You are most gracious, stranger. We are now as ready for the Mulligast as ever. It comes every night, you see. It hunts us like frightened rabbits. But what are we to do? They say the beast is immortal, so we cower in our homes or flee to the wildlands. Yes, like that one poor fellow we met before. We haven't had the chance to ask about him yet. You've met benighted Ichabod, have you? Save your pity. He was a criminal and had to be exiled. We can only protect so many with mana so low. The mana is low? That is unusual and at odds with the increased Malagast activity. The answer must be in the monitoring station. If you want to reach the source of the Night Forest's mana, only Lucian has the key. Maybe he will help you now that our defenses are ready. not see the mana source gifted us by the old judge. The reason it withholds its bounty is all too clear. Judgment! Judgment for our wicked ways. We have fallen short of his ideal, so he averts his gaze from us and sends his vile abomination to terrorize us. <laughs> Only through purity can we atone. Only through the removal of the criminal and the denial of a new can we appease him. Ask him if we could not simply find and destroy this Malagast in exchange for entry to the mana source. How difficult could one monster be? The Malagast cannot die. It raises the dead to serve it and screams the scream that freezes stars. It's not a subtle thing. Easy to find, if you wish. The Malagos makes its wretched nest in a clearing beyond the village. Seek it if you dare, but we will not mourn you. Avast, monster, your reign of terror uh, ends here. <coughs> oh, fie, never have I actually seen a star turn cold and fade away before. Goop. I believe yet another crane requires your aid.
and there expires another star. Quickly, friend. And there expires another star. Quickly, friend. We must pursue that creature before it escapes. <laughs> <laughs>